has agreed to take 20,000 refugees from Afghanistan. Here we go again. This country is heading for conflict. We already have division. We already have growing crime. We already have people living in poverty. We already have Islamic extremism, Sharia, jihadism. And yet here we are, opening the borders for more. Once again, the interests of the British people are deemed less important than the interests of other people. The least important people in Britain are the British, especially the working class British. In a recent report, it was revealed that refugees to Britain are sent to live in the country's poorest areas. Does that surprise you? It doesn't surprise me. It works like this. The Guardian reading class, the left-wing champagne socialists, campaign for more and more and more refugees. They do this because they know full well that these refugees won't be living anywhere near them. Here are the areas with the highest level of refugees so far. All areas that struggle financially as it is. There are parts of this country where poverty levels are high, where people can't get an NHS appointment, where the elderly can't afford to heat their homes. And it's into these parts of the country that refugees are sent. And that will be the case with Afghan refugees too. What's more, these Afghan refugees will go to the front of the queue. They'll be housed while British people waiting years for housing will be told to carry on waiting. There isn't an NHS left for anyone else, but there will be for Afghan refugees. That's what's going to happen. Afghans are already responsible for growing crime in Europe, and the chances are they'll bring crime with them again this time. But the politicians don't care, and nor do the champagne socialists, because that crime will take place in working class areas, not theirs. This is the truth of the matter. What is also true is that this will keep happening. For as long as we keep voting for the current occupants in Parliament, you must change this and change it now. We cannot pass on a functioning country to future generations if there is nothing left. We deserve better. The elderly deserve better. The working class deserves better. We can get it if we change our political representation away from the current crop and instead vote for ourselves. Vote for Britain. Thank you for watching. If you would like to stay updated with all of our latest videos, please like the video below and subscribe to our channel. As you probably know, For Britain is shadow banned on most social media, so it's really important to like and share our videos in order to get our message out. Thanks again for helping us to fight back. Thanks again for helping us to bring back Britain.